Hello viewers, welcome to my Windows Server video tutorial. Today I will show you how to install and configure remote desktop services in our Windows Server machine. Viewers, you can see that this is my Windows Server machine. Now I will show you how to install remote desktop services role feature in our server machine so viewers let's see how to do it for this at first we need to go add rows and features and then from the coming window press next again next and here you can see this is my computer name and its ip address is and this is the microsoft windows server 2012 standard now again press next viewers this is our rose windows in our windows server machine viewers i am using my i am using windows server 2012 r2 and after coming below you can see your remote desktop services select it and then press next from the features window we do not select anyone press next again next uh, these six rows are available in our remote desktop services the first is remote desktop connection broker the second is remote desktop gateway the third is remote desktop licensing and the fourth is remote desktop session host fifth is remote desktop virtualization host and the sixth is remote desktop web access i am selecting here remote desktop li licensing and then remote desktop session host and again remote desktop web access i am selecting here three rows and then now i am giving next I am selecting it to restart the destination server automatically if required and then press yes and press install. Here's my installation process is ready and it is installing. After completing installation I will come back again. Here's my installation process has been completed successfully and my machine is restarting yeah, you can see that my machine is restarting here hello viewers now i am logging my server machine I am giving username. Press enter. Yes, my server is getting ready. It will take some time. Viewers, my installation process has been completed successfully. And you can see here remote desktop services option. Now we'll go to tools menu and okay, viewers. Let's me do something. This is our window that shows their installation program, the pro progress that we are that we have to, uh, done recently now i'm closing it by pressing close button and then now we will go to tools menu and then from here select terminal services and rd licensing here two option has rd licensing diagnoser and remote desktop licensing manager and if we click on remote desktop licensing manager 
from here will we can like uh, sense our server machine i'm showing you but i'll not license it now but i'm showing you it now here right click on machine name and then activate server and after pressing next next uh, and giving by giving your license code you, you can uh, you can license for your remote desktop services but if you do not license you will get this service for 180 days and after 180 days you cannot use it okay viewers now i will use one user and i will i will log in remotely from another machine in this server machine okay viewers again go to the tools menu and computer management yeah from here i will create a user i'm giving its name user no no rd user sorry user one sorry rd user rd user your full name rd user and password i'm giving it and then i'll check mark user cannot change password and password never expires and then create and it has been created here so you can see here rd user and double click on rd user and i will give it a member of remote desktop user so go to member of tab and from here click on add button advanced and go to find now and from here we'll select remote desktop user this is the remote desktop user and double click on it and press ok viewers you can see that our rd user is the this is the member of users and also this is the member of remote desktop users ok press apply and ok ok viewers i'm creating a user that username is rd user now i'll log in so or remotely log in from my client machine this is my windows 7 client machine i'll remotely log in this this server at first i need to know the server ip address its ip address is 192.168.220.130 go to run window by pressing window key and r and press m s t s c and then press enter and this is the ip address 192.168.220.130 and then connect then give an ip address sorry give the username rd user and its ip address sorry its password three then it's okay from the coming certification window press yes 
bears you can see you, you can see that i am remotely login my server machine by user rd user okay viewers this is the process of installing configuring and remotely login in our server machine viewers i am closing my video here in my next video i will come again by taking another very important topics of our windows server till then okay bye bye